Danny Coote has got to take this corner on the left hand side. A little short. He's working on the training pitch. Here's Paddy Kirk. The greatest of deliveries, easy for Coffee. Here's Coote. Gone. Should be easy for the goalkeeper. Well, he had to deal with it. McIntyre's backward header. And Ula Uemi underneath his own crossbar. Yeah, it doesn't, get it over. doesn't get much on him, does he? Cute. Cantonde had to kind of dig when it was done extremely well, to be quite honest. He's made, made a lot out of that. See the Actually, keeper can't take. See right now he's switched. This will be an out swinger. In fact, he goes short. Didn't forget the return ball. Here's Coot. Coot works his way through. Coot towards the back post. Oh, oh lovely cushion header. And Grant Horton scores his opening goal for Bohemia, the 21 year old on loan. One League Two at Cheltenham, and he's put Bowles ahead in the 19th minute. Well worth corner, good headed finish by Grant Horton. Well, straight out the training ground, isn't it? Ali Q takes the corner, a little bit of an interchange after Labby holds up extreme. Yeah, lovely, a lot of flows. We have to show some good feet here, Ali Q. Side pass, which dinks it into that area. Bender is waiting at the back stick. He's not coming on to be stood still. He's done really well to generate a lot, a lot of energy. Just bangs it into that far stick. Settles in the corner of the net. Just possessed, but he's just he's about to get the ball back. Flores, a nice turn from former Dundalk man. Kirk keeps his run going. Here's Coot. Good effort on target. Straight into the keeper. Good luck from Back to turn the screw now, aren't they? Kirk and Bob here. Strike two, he's been kind of cut across and just hit the target. See what he's trying to do, isn't he? The, the great man now. Penny for his thoughts, John. It's been all too easy for Bowles at the moment. Well, there's, hope, there's hope, it's just the one goal in it. It's all the first half stats that were heavily in favour of the visitors. And you can see why, once again, it's an easy. Ball taken away. Here's Flores. Oh, that's terrible goalkeeping. It's the bend on the ball. Beats the Loney. And it's 2 0. It was a giveaway ball initially. And that could be game set and match as well. This is Cork City. It's a baptism of fire back in the Premier. Bowls lead 2 0. I'll tell you what. Started from Kostovic as well with the throw in. Flores. Have a look at the 50 50 challenge that happens in the lead up to the goal. Flores has just gone right through and Kostovic has pulled out. Have we get a chance to see it yet? Look at Flores. Look at that determination. Wins the ball back, no pressure, no one's come near him whatsoever. Gets a shot away. Goalkeeper. Well, your guess is as good as mine. Just stands where he is, it's gone straight into his arms. That just sums up Cork really at the moment, unfortunately. So your pitch is the bet. So he's got to take it left footed. Oh, it's straight at top, but bounced up in front of him. Fortuitous, nobody was following up. On target, first one received Cork City on target. Couldn't be top on the end. Yeah, the difficulty for the keeper is that it's bounced right in front of him. I think he's meant that wimbo. It's good pace. It does certainly get a little bit of a hop, doesn't it? Yeah, I, really, I can't stand anyone saying that's just staying the defender. Here we go. Uh, Gary. Oh, towards the back post and nicked away by Buckley. Did his job there, the captain. Yeah, you're wondering why Bowles is struggling to get someone to fill in that right fold. This is exactly why they put Keith Buckley there. He sees the danger. Have a look at that. Two players coming around the back. The action of his goalkeeper says it all, doesn't he, really? This corner of the second half, then. Two in the first. It's decent length. And decent keeping as well. Oh, but gets underneath it and just knocks out of the danger zone. Well, it's coming back to Uemi. Different debut for Ola Wemi today. <laughs> for a second. He's himself in the centre half having little words. Well, you can tell he's had a good scream, hasn't he? Strikers, <laughs> one of three Swedes involved this year. Nimbo has gone off. Kustovic is still on the pitch. In Denmark for Velja BK. Kustovic. Oh, it's there. And Keating has suddenly lit the touch paper for Cork City. It's a game riddled with mistakes. Thomas not happy with that. Keating gets his first goal of the season. It's 2-1. And he's apologised to the goalkeeper. He knows he's made an absolute howler. He spoke about the goalkeeper making for Cork making a howler. Well, this is just as bad. You've got to get huge credit for Keating. He was always around, wasn't he? 
Oh, he's got good strikers too, just in case something happens. But there he is, a little bit of composure. He's slapping into the back of the net. It's 2-1 Cork, and now it's a different game completely. He's got an opportunity now to put balls under huge pressure. Well, he's got his side, dragged his side back into the game. And in the last minute, plus out of time, we're looking at Sean Grant on that far side of fourth division to see what to be added at the end of this game. It's a good ball in two. Plenty of players in green up. And then the header across goal by Kresic. And it doesn't find its target. But it was a free header. It's a free header, John. He's completely unchallenged. And it's coming, you know, it's come down from a height. No one's got near him. You can see he just gets up a little bit too early and he's heading it on the way down. He's not able to get that kind of power to generate it, but he's done it really well to kind of guide it towards that far stick. And there he is, a long throw then. Palba comes oh. and tries to claim. And off the line by Kirk. Bull. Bull's living on the edge. Keating's header on. Talbot claims. Oh, Paddy Kirk saved Bohemian skin there. Wow, John. Wow. I mean, he's done that extremely well the whole game, Talbot. He's come off his line, he's commanded that area, but he's completely made a mess there. Obviously, the injury's not playing well, but Paddy Kirk, take a bow because he's just got your team out of jail there. Absolutely fantastic covering, defending. Healy takes it. Good one, two. Oh, was the back oh. post, and then they forced oh. it over the line. Well, they're claiming it. Talbot dived on it. And the referee says no. Oh, well, what a finish, John. This is incredible. Dara Crowley claiming the goal. There goes the full time whistle. And relief for Bohemians who were leading by two goals to one. Talbot's mistake then led to that Keating reply. And it, this is what happened again right at the very end. They might just get another look at coming in again. Really good angle here. As Crowley's got the header. Talbot gets down. Oh, he's done well, he stopped it. Yeah, he's done really well. No goal. Big, big save from the goalkeeper. Well, they tried their best to get something out of this game in the last couple of minutes. Healy went close, and now the substitute went very close as well. Crowley and Krosich as well. In the end, though, very entertaining game, it has to be said, for the first game of the season. And Bowes take up all three points, perhaps fortuitously in the end. It's finished Cork City 1, Bohemians 2.